There's a lot of haunted buildings in Globe. Two years before Arizona became a state, the 1910 Gila County Sheriff's Office and Jail opened. The rustic building may have stopped incarcerating prisoners in 1981, but some say today, spirits still live behind these bars. Wittles. The Phoenix, Arizona Paranormal Society tours the jail at dusk, waiting for full darkness. This is going to be great. Yeah. As the light weakens, the gridded silhouettes disappear. Um, is anyone going with you? Yeah, you are. The investigation begins. The team splits up. Rod and I go into a cell where a prisoner was shot. This is where we get the voice every time. Every member wears a tape recorder. This is where the bullet came through here and killed person to sell, yes. Some hold sensors that detect a change in electromagnetic fields, believed by investigators to prove paranormal presence. One more time. I see the meter going up. See it? There it is. Thank you. Hang on to it. I'm getting a chill. Hang up. To it. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Just hang on to it. Can you walk away? Wow, I can feel my way through my hand, dude. It's like vibrating. Walk away, walk away. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. One of the active areas is a common room on the second floor. The team sits on the skeletal beds and cells that once housed prisoners. At one point, Rod sees a silhouette pass by. I just saw something. You're right, Rod. Most of the evidence that we get is from our uh, EVPs, electronic voice phenomena, which is uh, captured through our audio recorders. So, so we don't really hear it at the time. So when we go review all the evidence, we can hear some whispering or some kind of talking. Each member spends hours after an investigation carefully listening to the recordings. Here are two whispers the team discovered. <laughs> Trying to capture supernatural activity is their passion. I've always believed that there's something going on, um, something outside of the box of our day-to-day -day life. The spirit world has always been fascinating to me, and there's more proof to me that something out there exists than the other way around. The team hopes these ghostly adventures will shed light and belief in the darkest of places. In Globe, Brian West, 12 News at 10.